Okay, Assalamu alaikum, student sub class seventh. Okay, this is subject maths. Okay, open your uh, maths textbook. Okay, let's try to find the solution of question number five and six, exercise one point three. Exercise one point three. Okay, so let's start. So the question number five is find the product using suitable properties. Okay. See here the question number uh, uh, five. A part is twenty six multiplied by negative twenty six multiplied by negative forty eight. Plus negative forty eight. Into negative thirty six. Negative thirty six. Right. Okay. See here. You can see here forty eight is in multiplication of this twenty six and the same forty six forty eight negative forty eight is in multiplication uh, with minus thirty six. Okay. We can use the property uh, uh, the distributive property uh, here. Okay. See, actually, this this forty uh, eight is distributed over twenty six and thirty six. So we can put it like this: minus forty eight into then brackets twenty six, right? So we have already taken this out: minus forty eight and minus forty eight. Okay, product, and then here remains. Twenty seconds, then plus and minus minus, then can negative thirty six, right? Which is equal to minus negative uh, this forty eight into brackets. This is plus minus. That means signs are different. Okay, so it will be twenty six minus thirty six. Right then brackets, which is equal to negative forty eight into twenty six minus thirty six is equal to ten. Okay, since so this uh, the thirty six is carrying the negative sign, so it will be negative here. Okay, so let's try to multiply this. Okay, we know the rule. Okay, when the two integers are in product and uh, both having the same sign, so the product the sign of the product will be positive. Forty-eight into ten is equal to four hundred eighty, but passed. Okay. So this is how we can solve the question number one. Okay, this is already solved for you. Okay, see question number uh, this uh, uh, this five B part. Eight into fifty-three into one twenty-five. So we can see here. We can actually uh, this uh, this we know that the, the integers are uh, commutative. Uh, for uh, for uh, this multiplication, so we can take this eight here. See here, fifty uh, three into eight into one twenty five, so that we can multiply eight into twenty five, one hundred twenty five easily. Eight into one hundred twenty five is equal to minus one uh, thousand. Uh, okay, the answer will be this. Okay, similarly, there are other questions that are already solved for you. You can uh, see the, the, the you know you can check these uh, answers and try to uh, practice these questions at your home. Okay, then there is question number six. Okay, let's try to understand the question first. A certain freezing uh, process requires uh, that room temperature to be lowered from forty degrees uh, centigrade at the rate of five uh, degrees centigrade uh, every hour. What will be the room temperature ten uh, hours after the process begins? Right. You can see. Uh, uh, we can solve this. Uh, uh, this by Okay, what is the present temperature? So present temperature is forty degree centigrade, right? So present temperature is forty degree centigrade, right? Okay, so we have to lower the temperature at the rate of five uh, uh, degree centigrade, five degree centigrade for how many hours? For ten hours. So that means we can multiply ten here. Right, so we are actually lowering the temperature. Okay, so that means it will be minus five degree centigrade. So which is equal to uh, 
five tens are fifty degree centigrade. Okay. So now we have to see what is the uh, what will be the room temperature after uh, ten ten hours after the process begins. So let's let's subtract this forty degree minus fifty. That is equal to minus ten degree centigrade. Okay. This is the answer of the question. Okay. See here you can see that minus ten degree uh, centigrade will will be the room temperature. Uh, 10 hours after the process begins after the process of freezing begins okay okay this brings end to today's topic uh, we will come up with another topic tomorrow inshallah till then khudafs thank you stay home stay safe